Hi, everybody. Welcome back to another session of One Question a Day. The question that we are going to discuss today is the function of periodontal ligament. The function of periodontal ligament is varied. Know that the main function is supportive. It supports the tooth. It dissipates the force acted upon the tooth. By narrowing the, because of the narrowing of the forces by the PDL along various directions, it leads to compression of the elements of the PDL. And this compression is carried on by the collagen fibers, water, and the blood vessels, resulting by the leading to a cushioning effect and a dissipation of the forces in various direction at the narrow down effect. On when the fourth tooth acts, when the force acts this tooth on the opposite, they widen and prevent the tooth from moving farther. Hence, it is called as a suspensory ligament, like a suspensor in the car. So, the fourth is dissipated in two ways. One by the cushioning effect, then by the acting as a suspensory ligament. That is the supportive function of the periodontal ligament. Sensory, they have efficient proprioceptive mechanisms. Due to these stomal cells that are actin dependent and sensory system, they are able to sense the changes in pressure and convey that to the nerves, to the spinal cord and the brain from which they ac accept the reaction, Could be fight or flight. Nutritive, there are numerous micro and macro blood vessels in the PDL, which provides Nutrition to the fibroblast, cementoblast, and osteoblast. If blocked, the, if the blood vessels are blocked, may lead to necrosis, necrosis of the tissue or very disastrous situations. In situations like diabetes, the blood vessels and the blood supply may be hindered. Homeostatic, the ability of the cells in PDL to form and resorb itself, thereby they can synthesize and resorb, for example, fibroblast, osteoblast, cementoblast, osteoclast. They have the ability to call for when needed to be resorbed and synthesize the cells. So they can function as synthesizes or resorptive cells. Together, they constitute or maintain the homeostatic mechanisms. Eruptive. People believe that the cells of the fibroblast via the fibronexus, fibronectin, or the blood vessels, the extracellular matrix in the PDL contribute to the tooth eruptions. So they are eruptive in functions. So the five functions are supportive via the cushioning effect and the as a suspensory ligament, sensory via the proprioception receptors, nutritive via the blood vessels, homeostatics by synthetic cells and resorptive cells, eruptive process. That brings us to an end on the discussion on the functions of periodontal ligament. Stay connected with this channel for another question on another day. Till then, happy learning.